Okay, how you doing? So I'm working on a set of stairs, and the stairs that are in there now, in the, in the location that I'm replacing, each height for each tread is different. It ranges anywhere from 7 inches to 7 and 3 eighths of an inch, and everything in between. I, with the new stairs, I want all the treads to be exactly the same height. I did my math, and I laid out this pole that you can see here, and it's just two rips of three-quarter inch plywood that I've got clamped together at the exact height from the floor to the second floor and with my math it came out to about seven and three eighths of an inch so I made seven and three inch in block and I could take that and I can place it here and make a line and then just keep moving up making sure that the line is perfect each and every time with a very sharp pencil point and that left me with about if you can kind of focus I'm about a half inch off from the top step so I had to adjust it so then I adjusted it to 7 and 13 30 seconds that gave me the third line and what you'll notice is even with these little tiny differences in measurements you'll see that the lines get added and they grow each and every time and by the time you're halfway up the stairs we're getting to some major differences in heights 730 seconds took me to the point where if I'm on this line I was actually beyond the top step I didn't like that. So <laughs> then I went to 7 and 3 eighths, but under 7 and 13, 30 seconds. And we ended up about an eighth of an inch short. And that's what I'm going to go with for my treads. But um, as you can see, this is the kind of thing that would make anybody crazy. And it's always a good idea to make a story pole like this. Uh, this way, you can't make any mistakes. I mean, you're laying it out. You know exactly what it's going to be. You're not relying on just the calculator. Some guys would have went with 7 and, and uh, 3 eighths. And then when they got to the end, they would have been off uh, with that top step. And it just wouldn't look right when it was finished. Of course, with this project, the floor at the top of the stairs is out over the course of about 43 inches. It's out almost 5 eighths of an inch. So we're going to have to do something to fix that as well. But um, I just thought... Some of you would like to see what I have to go through on these projects, and it is what it is. I love doing it, but man, it can really give me a headache.